or when my son is sad or when somebody screams at my son, even his dad, I, I'm so angry. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Agnes and welcome to my lifestyle channel. So, if this is your first time here, I say thank you so much for joining us and I'll be really, really pleased if you can click on the subscription button down below and the notification bell alongside it. So each time I post something, you'll be one of the first to get a notification from me. So thank you once more for stopping by. Returning subscriber, thank you guys so much for all the love, the support, the views, the like. It keeps encouraging me to do more videos. So I want to say thank you guys so much for all your support. You are amazing from the bottom of my heart. I say thank you. Moving forward on to this video, it's our modest day. We all know it's Mother's Day today and um, everybody's celebrating their mothers. Um, everybody was born by a mom, of course. Everybody has a mom, right? This video, I'll be talking more about um, those whose mom are no more in existence. Like they've passed through this life and they've gone to a different place. Yeah. I know on such day a lot of feelings are being arose and a lot of hurt. People are sad on this day, which is supposed to be happy, celebrating with loved ones, their parents, their mom, having dinner, having good time, buying gifts, sharing laughter, joy. But some people are sad because this day remind them of that. Their parents, sorry, their mom is no more. So this message is for you out there. I know, I know I've not lost a parent. I've not lost my mom nor my dad. Both of them are still alive. Mommy Malu, Mom Malu, happy Mother's Day to you. They are alive and they are breathing birth. I I uh, sympathize and condo with you all who don't have your mothers yet today because of that. Like it's so painful. I've never lost a parent before, but I've lost I've lost people that I care so much about and the way I felt was really, really painful. Or somebody with my blood related to me. If I could feel that way, then I could imagine how you all have lost your mom are feeling. I watched my mom and dad when their parents died. My mom is the only child of her mom. When that her mother died, my grandma, um, her, I, I was named after her. My mom was devastated. I saw the pain this woman went through. She was so sad. Yeah, my mom, my grandma was, she was not that old, she was in her 70s. My dad, when the mom died, I think she was in her 80s. Then I was like, I was like 14 years old. And to me, I was like, ah, oh, grandma is old, you know, but old or young, they're your parents, they're your mom. When a mother is gone, it's a very painful thing. So I want to sympathize and condo with you. And I just have something to say to you guys, like, I know it's a loss today. It makes you think a lot about your mom, that she's not there anymore. You wish she was there. I have a lot of my friends who lost their mom this year. I think I have two of my friends that lost a mom and one that lost her dad. And it was so painful seeing how they went through the whole thing. It was so sad. And I felt so, 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 so painful. Like, it was so painful. Like, I sympathize with them. But I just want you to have this at the back of your mind. Just think of what your mom would say to you if she was alive today. Are you living up to her expectation? The thing she's doing right now, is it what your mother wanted you to do? Like, take for example, your mother wanted you to get a degree, go to school, get a master's, get a PhD. Are you living up to her expectation? If she look from where she is right now, either in heaven and look down on you, she's going to be proud and say, oh wow, that's the child. I left back there. That's what I wanted her to do. Are you living the life that your mother will want for you? If you're living that life, then trust me, your mom is surely pleased with you. But if you're not living that life, please rethink about it. Just, just snap out of it and go back to the way you think your mother will want you to live. In that way, you're celebrating her, like doing what she wanted. Like, oh, my mom right now, she don't want me to be sad. And then try not to be. I know it's so difficult to just snap out of the pain you're feeling. But 
I feel you. I celebrate you guys today. I pray for your parents, your mom. Like, may their soul keep resting in the bosom of the Lord. It is so hard. I don't know what to say to you guys, but be in there. Just hang in there. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep making your mom proud. Though she's not yet, but just imagine she's saying everything that you do. If you're about to make a wrong decision, just think about it. My mom going to be pleased with what I'm about to do. If no, then snap out of it and stop. So I know it's so painful today. I wish I had I had some kind of, I don't know, something to tell you guys how you feel. But I really do not. Shout out to all my friends who lost their moms. Like We celebrate them as well today. Though they are not here physically, but you are a representation of your mom you know so live to her expectation what she expects of you to do just live by that the woman she's made you to be the man she's made you to be have that in the back of your mind and celebrate her celebrate other mothers celebrate even your mom the memory she left behind think of the beautiful moment you had with your mom like the time you guys spent together the advice she gave you what you guys did together you can even do those things even if she's not there like just to feel like celebrate in the spirit of Mother's Day. Yeah, so, and also, I want to also celebrate all those women who've lost their children, who've lost their kids. Like, I know how that feels. I haven't felt it. I'm a mom. <laughs> when my son gets sick, <laughs> I feel like dying. I feel so, so afraid. I feel like something is going to happen to me. Like, a mother's love is something that is so strong. Then I can imagine you losing a child. I haven't lost one, but when my son is sick, or when my son is sad, or when somebody screams at my son, even his dad, I, I'm so angry. I'm so mad. That's just because of the love that I have for my child. So I know what you all are going through. I want to say God is watching over you. God sees everything. Just keep doing you. Hang in there, may your soul rest in perfect peace. I still, we still celebrate you today, even though the kids are no more. But we say happy Mother's Day to you and to the mothers who are trying to have kids. Women were trying to have babies, but they cannot. We celebrate you today for looking out on other people's children that are not even your biological kids. Like, we appreciate you for doing that with all of your heart. We love you. We celebrate you today on Mother's Day. We want to wish you all the best and that God gives and God takes. If God took your mom, God probably had a reason. She probably in a better, better place, rather, better place than she was on earth. So that is my message for you guys. Like, we celebrate your parents, your mom today. And I say happy Mother's Day to all those who have lost their mothers. And we pray for their soul. May their soul rest in peace. May their soul keep resting in peace. And may the good Lord keep giving you all the strength to go on each and every single day. Because mothers are one of every child's life. You don't have a mother sometimes, especially when you're too young. They mend your ways. But we're sorry that that happened to you. And eternal rest grant upon them, O oh Lord. And let perpetual light shine upon them. May their soul rest in peace. Amen. Let's get a moment of silence to all those who have lost their mothers, to all the amazing moms that have left this life and passed on to the next life. Moments of silence, guys. May their soul rest in perfect peace. I pray this video meets you. And may this video console your heart and restore some kind of peace and strength to you. Knowing that your mother is in a better place and that she's looking down on you from heaven. And she's shaking her head and saying, that's my child. She, he is doing exactly what I taught them to do. So guys, that's all I have for you guys today. Happy Mother's Day and... Be blessed. Be strong. God got you here for you. Hope this message bring a little bit of peace into your heart. Knowing that your mom is in a better place. 
okay thank you guys so much for watching by the way please don't forget to hit your button down below and the notification bell alongside it thank you so much for watching thank you for the support and i'll be seeing you guys in my next video <laughs> ciao